take and start the eraser cube. And uh, we're going to start right here. And uh, as you can see, I have all my pieces right up here. As you can see, I'm going to drag over my first box. And uh, notice I already have my grid set at inches. And so by doing that, when I drag this over, these are already an inch by an inch. So I don't have to change this dimension. I do have to change the thickness of this. So I'm going to start with the yellow piece. And as you can see, the thickness of it is 0.25 or a quarter of an inch. All right, now I'm going to need to do one, two, three, and four cutouts. So I'm going to put them all on the page right now. Um, as a, you, you're well aware, this is going to be yellow here in a little bit. So this one right here I'm going to start with is going to be 0.5 and 0.25. And I'm going to go ahead and hit shift in, in that piece, and I'm going to align them. I'm going to align it here and here. And I'm going to go ahead and group that and take that chunk off. I'm going to do the same with this piece, except for this side is going to be 0.25 or a quarter inch. And this one's going to be 0.5. And I'm again going to take hit shift and align. And it's going to be on this piece and this piece. And I group them. And you can see I have this chunk taken out and this chunk taken out. So it's a good start. Uh, now I'm going to take and this one's going to be 0.5 by 0.25. And then I'm going to go ahead, hit shift, and I'm going to align again on the outside here and on the top here, group them, and that is gone. Now, this one's going to be a little bit more difficult because, as you can see here, there's a little chunk that I need to take out. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make it 0.25 by 0.25. And I am going to hit shift and align these. So I'll align these first. Align it here and align it here. Um, actually, I want to line it up here. Okay. I'm not going to group it yet because it's not in the right spot. As you can see, it's a quarter of an inch over. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to take and grab it. And I'm going to move it until the computer says a fourth of an inch. So you see right in the screen there, it says a fourth of an inch. I cannot move it this way, but I have to move it along the edge here. And I moved it a fourth of an inch. And then I can hit shift. And I can cut that out, and it's taken care of. All right, now I'm going to take and add my text, and it's going to be the A piece. Um, the height of it is actually going to be 0.3. Um, that doesn't seem to work very well. So what I've had to do was, instead of having the height right here, is I've had to take and click on the object and make it point. Um, Click on that, and you can't see a 0.3, and that works a little bit better. Okay, so you can see I clicked on the height of it. I'll undo that. Clicked on the height of it, and I made that 0.3. Okay, and then I need this to be 0.25 by 0.25. Enter. Then I just simply move this object over to it, like that, and I hit Shift, group them and I make it yellow. Okay, so there's my first piece. All right, I'm going to uh, do the green one next, and uh, we will keep going.